just getting myself ready for church. My head is hurting. It's a tunnel already though. I think it's just hurting because I'm tired. Um, the recital was awesome. The second show went by quick to me. But it was a two hour show. Both were. We are going to church. And then after church, we're going to go eat. And then I have my graduation. So I barely got any pictures with my kids. Like, just me and the kids together. But, I tried to get some darn dress for us. So. Let me show you guys my graduation dress. Here it is. The one I tried on in Kohl's. And then I got these earrings from Kohl's. I thought that was cute too. And then here's my makeup. It's gonna be a great day. Not sure how much footage I'll get on the camera, but I will do um, a, a TikTok. So go check out my TikTok, and I'll, obviously I'll get some pictures of my graduation outfit, dress, and all that stuff. I have my phone with me during graduation. My sweater's in the car, so I'll put it in my pocket. Hope you guys have a great day. Have a great week, weekend, whenever you see this video. Um, it's graduation day. I feel like Elsa and Anna. It's coronation day. So. Hey guys, in the car with Mark. Well, he had to run back in the house because mom forgot graduation tickets. Uh, this is my breakfast. This little lemon blueberry bar. Um, and I also have goldfish to snack on because my head hurts. But, yeah. Time for graduation. Well, church first. Then graduation. Secure the tickets. Here they are. Alright, let's go to church. My phone's not turning on. Ooh. Okay. My head actually hurts, so I might have to take this off soon. I just want to show you guys. She'll get me home. They gave us. I already have the degree at home because they emailed it, and it's already in the um, frame. But here it is, what they gave us today. Good morning, beautiful people. <sighs> what a weekend I just had. Busy, busy, accomplishing, rewarding exhausting long weekend but like I said a rewarding weekend because it was um the studio that I work at dance recital and then um I graduated with my master's degree in school counseling so it was a great great time and I think I'm more exhausted because of the days leading up to recital we have um a tech rehearsal then two dress rehearsals and then from there we have our show and we have two shows in one day um and then usually we have to you know load everything back into the truck and all that stuff and clean up the rooms and make sure the school is you know decent when we leave and all that stuff um sorry my stomach is like over here doing something some flips and tricks um and then after we do all of that, we normally, um, us teachers and staff, go out to eat and have a drink and everything. So did that. Got in mm, not too late, but late. And then had to wake up the next morning, and it was awake all day Sunday. So I'm, I'm still feeling it today. Like, if I wasn't going to the beach today with Kendall and Leah, then I would be back in bed after dropping my little brother off, especially because this is my first full week and first couple days of not having 75 hard. So um, I'm just really wanting to let my body relax and rest and just heal uh, because my hip is still hurting really bad. 
Um, and my ribs have been hurting as well. But like I said before, I think it's just overuse of my body. My body has just been overused for 75 days. And I have never done that before. So I got to just get my body back into um, a good spot that I feel good. Um, there we go. That I feel good about. Um, so yeah. That is what's what's up. What's what's happening? Life update. I got these barbecue chips because I love barbecue chips. And then I got the girls candy, sour patch, and marrows. And they both like those. And then I got myself a hash brown for this morning. I'm about to head on the road, and then when I get there, I will text one of them. Bye. Driving yeah, a right cart. Apparently, it was really cool. <laughs> Or, or in Delaware, honey. I know. But that's what she said. I meant no. to say it at home. I was freezing this morning. Yeah, it's just different down here now. Yeah. Hours later. <laughs> <laughs> Did not vlog. We are in okay. the Campa. I'm all about Leah's in the pate. Hey! <laughs> I forgot I had my camera and I didn't vlog. I didn't vlog anything all day. We went to the beach. We did. We got she, burgers. She got burnt. I got burnt. Yeah, look at her legs. Look at our boat. You see my bag too. Homegirl red. Yeah. <laughs> They're about to go have fun and I'm about to go home to my dog. Hey guys, I am back home. I've been home actually for a little while <clears throat> from the beach. I stayed all day didn't think that was gonna happen but it was fun the food was good company was good i got my dad the salt water taffy because that's his favorite and then we got matching um crew neck row with beach shirts and i got a large because i liked oversized clothing um kendall has one like this so me and leah got the same color so that is that I'm glad to be home. Um, I didn't vlog a lot because we were just chilling on the beach and relaxing and enjoying ourselves. And then we went back, back to the camper, um, watched, nailed it. I changed my clothes. Um, we did that for like an hour and a half or so. And then went to eat at Summer House. That was my first time there. It was so good. Crab dip is busting. It's amazing. It's 10 out of 10. Highly recommend. Um, I tried the, I think it's called smoking s'mores drink. S something s'mores drink. And it was okay. I will not get it again. But I did want to try it. I wish they had samples when you want to try drinks. Because then you pay like the full price. For the drink and you may not like it so you're like wasting it in a sense but i don't like to waste food or money or alcohol so i just finished it and then i had a caesar salad with shrimp and the shrimp were really good i could tell they used like egg egg batter on the shrimp and then the girls had burgers and then by the time i was got it, getting back it was like seven and then headed home when they were heading out and now I'm home but I'm about to get ready for bed and I will see you guys when my camera is charged tomorrow it's 9 45 so good night hey guys it is way way later and the next day today is Tuesday I have my watch on but I Woke up, got my little brother to the bus stop, and then went back to sleep for like two and a half, three hours. Then got up and helped organize some stuff for my dad. And then had a little bit of lunch. It was like three, four meatballs um, with like a spoon, like two tablespoons or so of um, some of the Italian sausage medley that my mom made with veggies. And then after that, I went to the dollar store and Safeway because today I am making a parent trap Disney inspired meals 
today for my family and I've done this in the past like last summer I started doing this and it is the most fun thing to do especially if you love cooking um, and then also try new, new things so that is what I'm doing today because um, I just remembered before I put the chicken patties in the oven so that they can cook up a little bit before I put everything else in I want to make sure that it's cooked well so things that I had to get for the meal is I'm doing a chicken parmesan with spaghetti and noodles I've never done chicken parm before so this is my first time doing it I'm gonna do cornbread the martinelli sparkling cider and then a s'mores dip with peanut butter for Oreos but I also got graham crackers just in case nobody wants the Oreos and the dip but I decided to make a Pinterest board like I haven't done that in the past don't know why but it like helped me stay organized in what I was getting and I just titled oh, I just titled it Disney meals and there's the peanut butter Oreo and there's the s'mores dip and there's the parent trap um, movie right there the film and then there's cornbread honey cornbread and then the Martinelli sparkling cider and then chicken parm so that is the inspo for today I'm doing this parent trap complete soundtrack on Spotify and it's it's set in the mood for parent trap night so I'm gonna get cooking and I will show you guys as I go or once I'm finished what everything looks like so see you later guys this looks so good I made sure the cheese was nice and melted and cornbread don't mind the little holes I made sure it was done and then little spaghetti sauce on there put all the sauce in here will make up for the sauce not in there <laughs> And I have to make sure to cover those two. And now I'm about to make the s'mores with peanut butter. Let's see how it looks. Dessert is done. And now I'm tired. So, here are the crackers. Yay, I did it. Hey guys. I am so tired. Did dishes, put the food away. Food was good. And finished watching uh, the Parent Trap movie. Now I'm in my PJs. And I'm about to go to sleep. I have an interview tomorrow morning. Um, it's really early. 7.35 in the morning. Um, so I'm super excited about that. And because I'm so tired right now. I just want to get into bed early. And relax and rest. So that I'm energized and well prepared. Um, and have energy for my interview. So that is the plan right now. Just, I'm calling it a night and I will see you guys um, tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. <sighs> Wednesday. Um, it feels like a Thursday, but today's Wednesday. I'm super excited. I'm a little nervous. Not really, but I also am at the same time because... I really want this like I want a job in a school district so that I can get my footing I was in a school district but they mm -hmm. no longer have my position at all that I was in so and I wasn't offered another position after that so I was kind of fending for myself for the past um, school year and it's been really hard it hasn't been easy but I have had faith belief in God that all things we're going to work out and are going to work out according to his plan and I've just been trying to be patient like after the holidays like after I came back from Europe from the next month because I got myself time to like recuperate from Europe time and everything in January but from February till about April I want to say and a little bit of May um, I was just job searching every single day and in the beginning of the year like the first couple months I was probably job searching every single day especially within the month of February I was just looking up jobs and trying to find something but nothing was popping up and that's the thing with school counseling is I try to tell people when they ask like oh what are you doing now it's like first I just graduated um, I've been done school since December but I just graduated in June and then also school counselors it's not a vacant position 
normally. So once somebody is in that position as a school counselor, whatever district they're in or however old they are, they're in that until they're retiring or when, after their kids go off to college years after that. Or unless it's a, somebody that is young and they got a position elsewhere or moved. Like, you know, that that's the only thing with school counseling is it's so hard to find a position that is vacant and open. Um, that's why I was highly suggesting and considering moving. And I still am, but um, I just don't want to settle for anything. But I'm hopeful that getting my foot in the door for this pair position at um, the school will help me becoming a school counselor because they said there's no vacant school counselor positions but a good way to get my foot in the door um, and get my name out there especially within this new school district would be good for me so fingers and prayers I've already prayed today and I'm hopeful and prayerful and have faith I'm just gonna keep believing and I'm about to see what I want for breakfast and if I want anything at all, if not, I'm just going to lay back down. So, I'm in bed. Um, I'm not feeling good at all. My stomach has been hurting all day. Um, and uh, it's been like a upset stomach and queasiness too. Fine, Sunday and Monday and Tuesday. It's just Tuesday night into the morning or for Wednesday. I just haven't been feeling good, so <coughs> hopefully I feel better. Go on a lay down. Hey guys, what's up? Um I have not been vlogging a lot today. Please chill. Because I haven't been feeling good. Hence why I have tea. Mmm. Tastes so good. Chamomile tea helps. And I also had to go get ginger ale because I did not have any ginger lime poppy and did not see any. So I had to get ginger ale. I had to cave in to actual soda. I'm trying to watch YouTube on my TV right now, but for some reason it's saying my Fire Remote is not able to play YouTube for some reason, so I have to like screen my phone onto my TV. So I was getting a little bored um, because since I've been asleep all day, um, I kind of just want to watch something. So I did watch two. I think YouTube videos. Um, Samantha Nicole, she's one of the um, YouTubers that I follow. And then I just uploaded um, some clips for a vlog that is going up tomorrow because tomorrow is upload day. And I almost forgot that, but I remembered when I was downstairs watching somebody else's vlog and her talking about her upload day. <clears throat> Excuse me. So. Um, I put everything on. Let me show you guys. Yeah. Clips. I use iMovie for all my editing um, things. And then for my music, um, I either screen record or do like the voice memo. Oh my god, I'm breaking out right here, over right here, and then on this side. But believe it or not, right now I am about to watch something that I've never watched before. I've seen people talk about it, <clears throat> seen it on TikTok. And all that stuff, but I've never watched it myself. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, it's called The Summer I Turn Pretty. Um, I know you guys are probably like, girl, you are late. Yes, I understand. But when it first came out, I didn't really watch too much of the like previews or trailer. And it, I just didn't watch it right away. I feel like I was probably doing something else or watching something else at that time that that was not a focus for me. But I saw a couple clips. I've heard people talk about it. And I saw some stuff on YouTube. So I have it right now on my TV. Season 1, I'm about to start it. And also, Season 3 is not out yet. So I have more than enough time to catch up. And I'm sure I will if I watch this all summer. Um, 
It probably won't take me all summer because I get through shows pretty quick if I find it interesting. So the first episode will be able to tell me if I like it or not. But I have a feeling I like this. So we are about to pop on episode one and see how it goes. So. Good morning, beautiful people. Um, I'm a little better. I will say definitely sleeping all day and just listening to my body and resting kind of helped. I'm still going to take what I eat today very carefully and not do too much um, because I'm not trying to end up how I was yesterday and I forgot my ginger ale so well, I usually use that to like settle my stomach. I feel like I need it right now but I'm just going to go with water and hope that that helps. I'm hoping um, my settled stomach stays settled and I'm good to go. Started. And I'm going to edit while I wait for my car to be done. Hey guys, I'm in the car, done at the, the service center um, to get oil change and everything. And now I am headed home. I am starving. I do want to stop and get something so that I don't have to cook. But I don't want to spend money as well. So either I'm going to go pick something up or I'm just going to make a sandwich or something when I get home. So we'll see when I get home. See you guys later. Bye. Good morning guys, so I am on the road to get some Starbucks for the fam. We have rehearsal this morning, my mom, my brother and I have rehearsal at church, so uh, we're going to be there till like 11 and I don't want my brother and my dad to not have something. But only thing is, I don't know what my dad drinks from Starbucks. Ooh, the sun is out today. Okay, now it's like so dark, whatever. Um, but yeah, so that's where I'm headed right now. I literally laid around, I can't speak. I laid around all day yesterday, basically. Um, actually took a nap on the couch, uh, watched movies all day, uh, barely ate. I didn't want to, you know, do too much. Um, I think I had like a sandwich, a little bit of a sandwich and chips, and then I had dinner. Um, and for dinner I had, I started to eat soup, which I don't know why I got lobster bisque. I was just craving it from being at the beach on Monday. But I did not eat all of that soup because I could tell it was probably gonna make my stomach hurt, so I stopped and I just had half of the sandwich. So I'm just gonna get like a, one of those fruity drinks that I get from Starbucks. So let's go to Starbucks. Hey guys, I am home with the goodest. So the drink my brother wanted was called the Pikachu drink. So this one is my drink. I'll show you guys in a second, all of them. Thank God for gift cards. So it looks so good. It looks just like the picture. Let me show you guys the picture he sent that he wanted. I don't know how he got it so fast. That one, look, it looks identical, but I had to change it up. So that drink is called the Pikachu drink. Well, Pokemon, Pikachu, same thing. Pikachu Frappuccino. Well, he said Frappuccino, but that is not what he sent me. Um, it's a, it was supposed to be a venti green tea lemonade, but because there was no raspberry syrup and I had to switch the raspberry for, because they discontinued that a long time ago, did not know that. I instead put peach juice in his drink. So instead, she did a venti iced peach green tea lemonade, which I didn't know they had. I have to try that. Um, and it's tango, passion tango tea on top, and then um, 10 classic pumps of syrup. So there's his drink. I actually want to try it. And then I got my usual um, strawberry acai refresher with lemonade and added peach juice. Taste so good and then i got my dad a caramel ribbon crunch frappuccino with extra caramel it looks so good hey guys it is way later in the day way way later in the day this morning after rehearsal my mom and i picked up dinner for the family early because we weren't going back up that way um so we got dinner from big fish um, grill and now, once I got home, I had my leftover half of my sub and a little bit of soup. And then I just sat down and binged 
the summer I turned pretty season two. As you can see, the big basket of clothes I have, I have to fold. finished cleaning what I needed to clean um, for today and switch out um, like uh, what was I saying? some winter stuff to summer things and now I am doing a much needed charcoal face mask and I'm gonna show you guys what I use in one second I'm trying to get Disney Plus on the TV and I use this clear proof can't really see it that way clear proof um, deep cleansing charcoal mask so right now I am looking for high school musical 2 because I'm in the summery mood of Disney right now so that's what I'm gonna do I can't really move my face right now too much, but I want to watch High School Musical 2 and enjoy some coloring and relaxing. So here's what I have so far. Of the wonder of Disney. I love it so far. And it's so funny. My case is the castle. So I was kind of looking at my, my case. Um, and then also something on Pinterest to kind of like figure out what this color was going to be. And there's the up thing. That's probably one of my favorite parts. Love it. I really love to color. So this was so much fun. Now it's time to get in the bed. <clears throat> um, I put my cup downstairs. Oops, for my tea. Um, yeah. So, hair's pulled back, and now time to get into bed and get ready for church tomorrow. Night. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. Um, right now I am finishing up getting dressed. Um. Just finished my hair and I'm putting my jewelry on. I slept so good last night. It's amazing when you do like a little bit of self care. Again, sorry for the lighting. When you do like a little bit of self care and just kind of do something for you and just relax. Um, how amazing it feels to do that so I hope you all take care of yourselves today and do something do something for yourselves today yeah I am gonna get ready to go have a great day um, and let's get this Sunday started Hey guys, <sighs> Tori's graduation party was super, super fun. Whenever I go somewhere that I don't know anybody, but like obviously the people that have invited me, I get very shy and I don't talk. I stayed on my phone for like 30 minutes, stayed to myself until one girl and her kids came over and asked if I was by myself and if they could sit at the table. And I was like, 
yeah, of course you can. And we had conversation. We talked about dance because our little girl is in dance. I told her about the studio that I work at. Got, we exchanged numbers. Um, so, and they're also going to Disney tomorrow. Her kids don't know. She told me though. So uh, it was really cool um, talking to her and her kids. It was so cute. They were all like, oh, Miss Ashley. And I was like, ah, stop. It was so cute. Um, but yeah, it was a fun time. The They had remarks where people came up and said things. And it got a little emotional. I was tearing up a little bit. I was going to go up and speak. But for me, for especially for the seniors right now that are leaving, that I'm very close with um, from the studio and stuff like that, it's, I feel like, from, and this is just a personal thing, like, if I was to say those remarks then, that would make everything more real that she is leaving and she is going off to college, and I didn't want to accept that at that point, so I told her, I was like, you know what, we're gonna have our last little outing together before you go off to college, and then that's when I'll share what I need to share and cry then, but I'm not gonna cry today. Um, so yeah, it was a great night. My stomach hurts, so I'm going to lay down and go to bed because I have to wake up early, get Eli to the bus, and then first day of camp. So I'm going to close the vlog out here and start a new one, and I will see you guys in the next video. Hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and let me know what you want to see more from me, and I'll be back with more videos. Peace.